This is not going to be yet another video about Area 51. Today I'd like to give you some information about the Nevada test site right next door. Now the Nevada test site is not a part of Area 51. In fact, it's run by the Department of Energy, while the rest of the Nellis Range is operated by the United States Air Force, as most of you probably know. Now, will you find secret underground entrances here at the Nevada test site? Well, no. You will find underground entrances. They have lots of underground facilities here. They're just not that secret. In fact, you can read all about them on their website. The U1A complex is an underground laboratory consisting of horizontal tunnels, each about one half mile in length, where experiments supporting the nation's nuclear stockpile are conducted. The tunnels are approximately 960 feet below ground level. I believe this shadow right here is the equipment they use to lower personnel and equipment down into the tunnels. The significance of this operation was recognized throughout our military establishment. Key representatives from all the services and other interested agencies were invited to observe this historic event, a critical first for the Army. And now we have the big daddy of them all, the Sedan Crater. To give you an idea of how big it is, that little line running up to it is a dirt road. Picture a car at the end of that road. Now, would you like to see the big boom that made this hole? Sedan was detonated at 10 a.m. July 6, 1962. This is a view taken from the top of a 1,500-foot tower 
located six miles from ground zero. This close-up view was taken from a ground station three miles from ground zero. The dome rose to a height of 290 feet before it bended at three seconds. 